Big man, Beck. Becky with the good hit. Wins the game in the final minute of extra time with a sublime header. 2-1. We win. We are back in the race for the top four. It's in our hands still. I know I said I wasn't going to get happy. I know I said I wasn't invested in this thing. But I can't help it. Liverpool win again. Chelsea under pressure. Leicester under pressure. Tuesday night is going to be immense. Yeah, we Go! Welcome back to another episode of the Football Babblers. This is not going to be a post-match review. This is an Allison celebration. It's Allison Wonderland right now. What a beautiful header. Man, we were throwing everything but the kitchen sink at West Brom, but nothing seemed to work. But Allison steps up. Our goalkeeper of note steps up and says, Rest, guys. Rest. I got this. I'll carry you. And he, he rises up with such a beautiful header. Beautiful. A, a striker of the Harry Kane himself would have been so proud of the header that, it, that, that Allison made. If, if, if Harry Kane had to do it himself, he would have been proud of that header. So for Allison, a goalkeeper to step up and to put that in the back of the net the way he did, my goodness. And not just that, not just that. I know that you saw how um, Phillips came bursting around him, dived with him, and I mean, like just swore past him for the header. That would have put anyone off, but not Allison. The fact that he still kept his eye on the ball, still steered it into the nets, amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Champions League spot is still wide open. Leicester has to versus uh, Chelsea on Tuesday evening. Uh, that game is going to be so, so huge right now. I'm so gassed. I'm, I'm pumped. I am pumped. We're going to do this. This this reminds me of the Barcelona comeback from 3-0 to win 4-3. Uh, uh, I think it was an aggregate. We, I don't care if it was 4-3, I'm just so guessed right now. But this reminds me of that. We have to make it now. We took United out. Now we've taken West Brom out. Coming from almost an obsolete situation. It looked like the nail was in the coffin. We were out. But we are back in it. Liverpool find a way. Well done to Leicester City and winning the FA Cup. Man, did you see how they brought their owner to come down and celebrate? Man, that's so beautiful. The man is, is so at one with the team. He's so linked with the team. There's such a relationship, a camaraderie. That was so good to see. I'm so proud and so happy for Leicester City. Well done to Leicester City on winning that FA Cup. And with a strong footing for Champions League. Although... It, Depending on how things go with Leicester City and, and United I mean, and Chelsea, it could be a bit shaky. But hey, nonetheless, I'm so proud of, of Leicester City. So proud of Rodgers. He's doing a great manager, great team. Uh, I wish them all the best. Well done, Leicester City. This is the Football Babblers. This is all I wanted to bring to you. I'm Lenji. Catch you in the next one. We're going to be watching the Leicester City and Chelsea game. We're watching that. Oh, yes, we're watching that. I'm out, people. Yeah!